Hello, sir. Yeah, what's up? It's very nice to meet you. What's up, man? You're speaking with USA Fox. Welcome to the channel. I'm here to give a voice to the voiceless. May I have your name? My name is Slime. Slime? Slime, yeah. Oh, oh, Salam? Yeah. All right, right. How old are you, Salam? 42. 42. And where are you from? Salem City. Oh. All right, Salem City. That's like the bottom of Jersey. Yeah, 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 yeah. What was it like growing up out there? Hey, man, it was rough, man. You know, you had to either you had to either you were slaying crack rock or you had a wicked jump shot, man. That's the only way you was getting out, man. Mm. You know, or you was running that pill, mm -hmm. you know. So, you know, and that's that's that, that, that's how I grew up, man. You know, that was you the know, circumstance. I, I had to grow up under 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 unfortunate circumstances, you know. Mom's fucked up, you know, dad in the wind, you know. So, you know, they had to grow up, you know, hard headed, you know, but you know, it is what it is. You had siblings? Not he knows, yeah, I had siblings. Three of us. It was four of us, actually. Mm -hmm. Three brothers and one sister. You know what I'm saying? Are you the oldest? Yeah, I'm the oldest. The I fell oldest. off the stoop. Went out there, started grinding, getting money, hustling. Fucked up a couple packages. Went down prison. Did a couple prison bids. You know what I'm saying? Here and there. You mm -hmm. know? And, um, you know. So what was it like when you jumped off the stoop? When I jumped off the stoop, you know, it was, it was difficult, you know? I had to learn a game, you know what I'm saying? I was fresh off the porch. I was green, so, you know, I had to learn a game, you know? Thing, you know what I'm saying? As far as learning the game, <clears throat> in the streets, you know, you know, you playing, you know, everybody play for keeps. Niggas ain't playing fair. You know what I'm saying? Things get critical. You know, niggas turn. You know. How were you introduced to that lifestyle? Just coming outside and just, you know, it's just the environment we grew up in. You know, okay. us, you know, we grew up on. What led to you coming out here? What Barry, New Jersey? Oh, um, you know, uh, I just had to, you know, separate myself from that, you know, because people was dying, bodies was dropping, mm. you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I had to get myself up out of that environment, you know. Now I stepped out here, you know what I mean? I'm out here stepping now, getting a little couple, get, getting to it, you know, doing what I do, and, you know. Are you currently dealing with any drug addiction? Yeah, absolutely, yeah, from... From my experience in Salem City and running the streets and uh, hustling, and you know, I picked up a PCP addiction, you know, smoking dip cigarettes, you know, and that and it has, has me uh, going through different phases of life, you know. How often are you using PCP? On a daily basis. Daily basis. Daily basis. How many times would you say daily? Daily. Three, four, five times a day, man. As much as any time I can get my hands on it, man. Smoking me a dip cigarette, man. How does it make you feel? Make me feel out of, give me out of body experiences, man. I me feeling like I'm other than myself, man. You know? Do you want to get off the substance? I mean, you want to get off of it, you know, but it got you in the, in, it got you in the bond, you in the grippers, you feel me? It's hard, you know what I'm saying? It's hard to just put things down that you pick up, you know what I mean? Addiction is hard, man. How long would you say you've been addicted to the substance? Man, since I was 17. I'm 42 years old now, man. 42 like years 24, old. 24, 25 years. Man, man. You know, I've been doing that off and on, you know, for years now. What would you say the difference is between, you know, this environment and Salem City? So, I mean, out here, you know, you don't got to walk around, you know, out in the city, you got, you know, they out there playing with them things, man, them torches, you feel me? Mm -hmm. They out there playing, for real. They playing for keeps out there, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Cell City, man, them niggas out there, they playing for keeps, You man. could possibly lose your life, huh? Yeah, you'll die out there in them streets, for real. Dude. You don't have to be involved in no street activity to lose your life. You don't have to be involved in nothing. Nothing. Innocent people, innocent bystanders get hit. People don't care. They coming out there, they looking to lay something down, man. They not, you know what I mean? What's Casualties the happen in war. 
What's the craziest or most dangerous thing you've seen out there? Man, I've seen bodies drop, man. Bodies drop, man. You know, I don't, you know. If you can make three wishes right now, what would they be? Three wishes, man. I wish we, we could definitely bring some more, bring more jobs and stuff out here for the people, man, for the mm -hmm. public, man. Mm -hmm. Transportation-wise and stuff like that, man. People struggling out here, man. Right. Can't get nowhere, you know what I mean? We're stuck in this box, man, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You know? mm. We're just trying to get out of this. What's your current living arrangements? Current living arrangements, man. Right now, I'm on the streets, man. I'm in these streets. Surviving? Survive. Any means necessary. Do you, do you get the, do you eat? Do you put nourishment in your body? You yeah, still manage man. to do that every day? You still right. manage to do that every day, man, you know. Manage to nourish the body, you know. Other than that, you know. Try to keep it, you know. It's PCP, your only drug of choice. You ain't never mess with them other substances out here that's, nah. you know, the tranquilizer and stuff that's nah, eating people, putting man, holes in stuff. people's body. Nah. Mm. I've heard about it though, and it's, it's definitely, yeah, things is definitely going haywire out here, man. Mm -hmm. I thought, you know, they took it to another level now, man. Or, you know, first it was just weed, wet, you know what I mean? Pills, perks, and all this K2 in this water. I don't know what it is now. Mm. Got them going crazy out here now, man. No, man. Mm -hmm. We out here, though, man. What advice would you give to the kids ripping and running the streets following in your same footsteps? What would you tell them? All I can say is, man, you know, you know, keep hope alive, you know what I mean? Mm. Keep hope alive, you know? You got these any? streets. Go ahead. These streets, the, the media, uh, these streets, you don't hear about things that happen in these streets because, mm -hmm. you know, they keep, they, keep, they keep it quiet, you know, but you know. You have any kids yourself or any loved ones? That's... Nah, I ain't got no kids. No kids? No kids myself, but, you know. You got any loved ones that want to see you up off these streets trying to help you out at all? Any support, family support? Nah, I'm all, I'm by myself. You know? I'm all right, grinding, struggling, all oh. Ryan, try and get it. Any way possible. I see you still uh you still you still stay fly, man. Try You know how to dress. You know. Is it is it easy? I mean, is it hard uh, you know, getting dressed up and you know. I mean, you know, I mean, you know, I stay fly, you know, that's just things. <laughs> that's just, just you. That yeah. ain't never gonna you know, change. Ain't huh? never gonna change, yeah. <laughs> you know. <laughs> What was it like uh, before all the drugs set in in your life? What was your life like? I know you had it hard, but, you know, any good times? Hey, man, yeah, man, you know. Did it up, had ball, mm -hmm. you know. Champagne, pop champagne, and did it all, man. Did it all, huh? Where you right. see it? Huh? Where you see yourself in the next six months, bro? Hey, man, next six months, man. Hopefully, man. Hopefully I see myself, you know, you know. Getting me a job or something, you know, right, and uh, right. you know, the right track, moving on the right track, you know, getting in the right positive direction, you know. I ain't gonna lie, you don't seem like a bad guy. Seem like you just took that wrong turn down that PCP road, and, yeah, you know. you know, it is what it is, though. But man. I see a lot of potential in you. And, yeah, yeah, you can get up out of this. Absolutely, man. When do you plan on getting up out of this and busting a move? I don't know, man. I'm trying to get up out of here soon, though, man. Probably go south somewhere, man, you know. Maybe go down south or, mm -hmm. you know. Are you religious at all? Nah. Nah. Spiritual? Nah. Nah. All right, Salam. I'd like to thank you for your time, man. You've been a wonderful interviewee for me. Any last words? Anything you want to say to the public, man? Anything you want to let them know? Nothing? Nah, anything great. Everybody be easy on y'all here. Jersey, you know what it is, man.
God bless you, brother. I'm praying for you to get up off these streets, man. man. Right. It's good. Easy. Hi, guys. USA Fox here. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for tuning in.